Hi and welcome to Tutorial. This is DeBrizo. If you've been in the internet marketing game for a while, you've probably heard of Twitter. Now, this little web app has taken the internet marketing world by storm. Many people are hailing it as one of the best marketing tools ever. Anyways, today I want to show you a tool that makes even Twitter more powerful. It's called TweetDeck. And you've probably seen tweets that say from TweetDeck. So many people are using TweetDeck to use Twitter more efficiently. And to use TweetDeck, you just have to go to TweetDeck.com and you'll find a file that will install it for you. And once you've got TweetDeck installed, there are four ways, um, there are at least four ways it can improve your Twitter produ productivity as well as making Twitter even more fun to use. So let me go over those four ways. First, here we're at TweetDeck. TweetDeck lets you set up multiple columns instead of just the one column that Twitter has. These multiple columns allow you to organize your Twitter content in an efficient manner. You may have heard that using multiple monitors improves productivity. That phenomenon is similar to using multiple columns on TweetDeck. So what kind of things can you put in these columns? Well, I think the biggest thing you can put in the columns is you can put the people that you follow into groups and then give those groups their own column. For example, here I have three groups. One is just uh, something I call high signal. These are the people on Twitter in my industry that talk a lot about my industry, whereas these this the people in this group, low signal, have more personal Twitter accounts. So they won't always talk about the industry. They'll talk about what they're eating, where they're going, just personal stuff. And finally, I have just um, a group of just my own tweets. So that's how I've chosen to use um, groups. And groups are pretty easy to, to use. You can just click here. And then you can give um, your group a name and then choose the group members for that group. And then click Save Group. Or you can just click the plus and once you this is only after you set up the group then you can put a check mark on the group you want this Twitter uh, this person on Twitter to be on and it'll uh, tweet deck will add this person on that group so that's uh, one thing you can put in the columns also you can have a column of replies people send you so here's my replies column and you can also pull it up by clicking here and then you can have a column with all your friends tweets that's the default column on Twitter and you'll see it pull up here there you go and then you can have a column with your direct messages so you can click that and actually I don't have any direct messages finally you can even have a column um, for a search term so we click that and let's I'm just gonna search the name of my industry it's a collectible card game magic the gathering let's close this and close this So here, as you can see, is a column of people that are typing in this search term, Magic the Gathering. So let's close this. Oh, by the way, and then you can organize the columns um, by clicking that and move columns around. Move stuff around. So these columns definitely improve Twitter productivity. I'm going to close this. There we go. Okay. 
So the second way TweetDeck can improve your Twitter productivity is it, it allows you to retweet with just one click. And you just click on the profile or put your mouse over the profile picture and just click here and then click here and you've retweeted that click um, that tweet so a lot more simple than having to copy and paste third TweetDeck allows you to quickly shorten URLs now before TweetDeck I often had to go to a URL shortening site but TweetDeck lets me skip that step so let's do a sample tweet I'm um, cool website and then I'll just put some web page and then here just click shorten and it's shortened for you so very good time saving process and finally TweetDeck lets you follow other Twitter members without having to go under Twitter profiles and waiting for those web pages to load so let's say I wanna follow this person I don't I haven't followed him yet I can just click oh actually I have followed this person sorry I'm gonna find someone okay this person I haven't followed so I can just click and shows their profile shows their tweets their most recent tweets gives some of their stats and then if I want to follow I'll just click here so pretty cool huh anyways hope you enjoyed this episode if you use TweetDeck let us know your experience and for more internet marketing videos be sure to check out tutorial.com